Hello, I'm Danny Kenyon. Thank you for joining us for this District News Minute. The Foreign Language in the Elementary School, or FLES, program has reached its final year of implementation. FLES began at Rosa Parks Elementary as a part of that school's Global Studies slash World Language program. Elementary students receive Spanish instruction for 15 minutes each day to develop basic Spanish skills. A new report for the school board shows that as those students got older, they transitioned to Patrick Henry and Whittier Middle Schools, where the program continued as a way to further cultivate students' language skills. Now, the earliest class of the FLESS program is in eighth grade, in the final year of the program, while many students were able to take high school Spanish courses throughout middle school, because of the program, the rigor of the classes weren't right for everyone, so other alternatives for students were adopted. District administration and staff will continue to monitor the program to find the best solutions for students. You can read the full report on the Sioux Falls School District's website. A new program is seeking to help some of the city's youngest learners develop coordination and reflex skills, which will help them in the classroom. The Ready Bodies Learning Minds program was developed by Athena Odin, who visited Sioux Falls to talk to the staff in the spring of 2015. Since that time, physical and occupational therapists and individual teachers have been implementing some of the exercises and motions into daily activities to help students focus and achieve. This year, a pilot program at four elementary schools seeks to further develop the program and track how students respond academically to the methods. The program was outlined for the school board at the most recent meeting, and you can find the full report as well as a video showcasing the program by visiting the Sioux Falls School District's website. And finally, even though there was no school on Veterans Day, many schools and programs celebrate veterans and observe the holiday in different ways. Last week, Sony Sotomayor Elementary held a veterans celebration focused around the husband of one of their secretaries, who was deployed on November 11th. The school invited other veterans to the ceremony and featured the Jay Rotsey from Washington High School, musicians from Edison Middle School, and more. Automotive students at the Career and Technical Education Academy have been working on repairing a ceremonial vehicle for the local VFW, and members of that organization were invited to a ceremony last week to see the progress and educate students about this important holiday. You can learn more about these and other Veteran Day celebrations by checking out the Sioux Falls School District's social media feeds like Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube. You can learn more about new initiatives, classroom projects, view fine arts performances, and sporting events, and get important information for parents and students by checking out the Sioux Falls School District's cable channel, KLEARN, your Sioux Falls Classroom Connection, on Mid-Continent Channels 20 and 595, or by visiting the website at www.sf.k12.sd.us. Join us each week for more news and information about your Sioux Falls schools. With this District News Minute, I'm Danny Kenyon. Thank you for joining us.